days here with the forecast, which also includes some snow. Yeah, first we freeze and then we shovel right on. Well, weather watchers were finding unseasonably mild temperatures as we went through the afternoon. 44 in Montgomery, 38 in Gurney, and Valparaiso, Larry at 41, and Terry had 39 degrees in Genoa. Temperatures are really not bad right now. In fact, we're in the mid 30s in most places. We have a 36 degree reading from Jen in Manhattan, a cloudy sky there. And she says, not too chilly for January 31st. Well, Jen, just wait till February because we are turning the page. These were the highs today, all in the 40s. Our normal highs, 32, so we're way above it. You know, January, for the most part, we did hit 55 times and we had five days with highs in the 40s. Well, that's all about to change. We have a cold blast coming our way tomorrow. These northwesterly winds are going to gust to 30 miles per hour, creating sub zero wind chills at times. We're not there yet, 37 degrees. We have west to southwest winds with this first boundary that brought us, brought us clouds. The second one, this is the one for the morning we're watching. It opens the door for this Arctic air mass to spill in. By 7 a.m., that's our daytime high. Temperatures falling throughout the day. By noon, 17, skies clear out. And in the afternoon, that wind chill value continues to intensify. So first, the Arctic chill. Then we track the snow. Now, Friday night, low pressure over Rapid City will target Omaha and eventually Chicago. What we expect expect to see is most of that snow happening Saturday, but especially Saturday night into Sunday. We'll have to keep fine tuning this as the storm gets closer. But as far as the snow forecast goes through four o'clock Saturday, so during the day it's kind of minor. But as we get into Saturday evening, we start to see those two to maybe four inch totals. Then overnight we ramp it up maybe six inches in McHenry by four o'clock on Sunday afternoon. So stay tuned on that one. What we know for sure is Arctic air is definitely moving. In. We know the snow chance develops Saturday. The big question is how much? So we'll have to see how that system overcomes this dry, bitter, cold air that's going to be in place for the next two days. Bundle up, guys. Now we know. Mm -hmm. Thanks, Mary.